Welcome to the old Lumens channel. I'm just going to uh, do a real quickie here on this uh, mod that I'm working on in the mag light because I've done so many of them. It's really a lot of it's just repetition. I have a 2D uh, mag light that I, uh, and it's an incandescent, but I happen to have a, I'll, I'll tell you in here in a minute. Anyways, it's an incandescent. I've done some file work. I have a little video that shows some idea of the file work, but uh, basically there's quite a bit of file work done on the light. Okay. Um, now what I'm putting into it is an MTG2 LED and copper star and I have an aluminum heat sink with a copper wrap around that. Um, uh, let me take this off real quick here, this head off real quick here. I've already figured out my, my, my heights and everything in my stack up. The uh, reflector is a uh, Maglite uh, LED reflector. Um, I've just cut off the outer uh, edge of the outer rim that that uh, controls the uh, uh, focus you know on in a regular mag light I've taken and just cut that off okay um, then I have a, a just a regular glass lens it's a coated lens but it's just a regular glass lens it's not AR or anything like that it's from Kai Domain um, <clears throat> And the the, uh, the heat sink is not a huge one, but it'll work fine. You can see I have a, uh, a screw right there in the body, and when I uh, put the heat sink in, it'll screw right into it. Uh, so I'll get some decent ground that way. Um, the uh, I'm I'm doing nine amps, so I'm going to use a Dr. Jones driver, and then I'm using uh, shown in another video. Uh, I'm using uh, 16 chips. On another board, so uh, uh, that that coupled with a stock driver will give me about nine amps. Um, so far, I've got the uh, um, wiring done. What I'm going to do is I'll be using a momentary switch, and uh, this is another. This is a BLF uh, base for a momentary switch. I bought some of those, and what I did was I removed the guts of the stock switch. And then I'm just putting stuff right through the hole. I've uh, put a positive wire that comes right through the stock switch, right through the center. Okay. Uh, then my uh, wires for the, the momentary switch go right through the center as well. I will retain the, uh, the negative because I want to use that Allen to tighten down and make the switch hold in place. And I will use it for a ground. Now, basically, I'm going to have two grounds because I'll ground through this where it goes through the side screw in the body. And I'll also ground with this so that I get, make sure I have a good ground all the way through. Um, I can't do much more until the driver comes in, which it should come in sometime this week. Dr. Jones' driver. It'll be uh, ramping. I really like those drivers. Um, that's about all. I mean, the uh, the reflector and lens fit right into the stock head uh, there's no big deal about that put the put the uh, uh, guts in it uh, wire it up and then just screw the head on and then I can adjust what I want for the overall height to get the uh, the best focus and then once I got the or I mean you know the tightest beam the best focus of the LED then once I get that, then I can make whatever spacer I need to make that permanent. Uh, and that's really all I have. Uh, I, like I said, I've also included in a video about how I do some of the file work because I know some people, you know, don't go look at all the past stuff. They just look at what's going on right now. So I made another little video on that. Other than that, I'll, uh, I'll uh, you know, touch this up and finish it off when I get the driver in next week. Thanks for watching.